So we're going to be taking a look again at Tula ammo, or however you wish to pronounce the name. I've given this ammo in the past a pretty crappy review, uh, primarily for the 30 carbine, which I put through my old postal meter M1 carbine. And I decided to give it a shot again after a lot of comments and emails from people saying, oh, it was probably my gun's fault. I do not, just to clarify, believe that it was my M1 carbine's fault because I cleaned the heck out of that gun, uh, took it out multiple times, and it would not fire this stuff worth a damn. But it fires every other manufacturer's ammo perfectly fine. That being said, uh, I'm pleas pleasantly, ugh, pleasantly surprised by how accurate and reliable uh, the 7.62 by 39 is. Now I put this stuff through my AK, which ate it up with no problem. I bought a thousand rounds. I actually got this stuff from Walmart and uh, put about a thousand rounds through it. And I'll be buying a lot more of it. It's as dirty as tool ammo always is. It's as dirty as Wolf and a lot of the other cheaper, you know, Russian overseas companies make ammo. But if you've got something like an AK or an SKS who really cares how dirty the ammo is, you just clean it out. And as pretty much with any gun, even ARs, uh, as long as you're smart enough to clean your gun out thoroughly after a trip to the range, you're not really going to have any issues. As far as accuracy goes, it was as good as everything else. Uh, I had literally and all the ammunition that I fired through that AK, and there's a Century Arms uh, 93 Classic, the, the all-American version, it had not a single issue, not one failure to feed, not one failure to eject. I will say, hands down, that this ammo, by far, is something that I would be willing to put through my AK. Now, if you ask me again if I'd be willing to go buy more of this and try to put it through my carbine, absolutely not. I've already proven that this ammunition, the 30 carbine Tula ammo, does not work, in an M1 carbine. Uh, there are people out there who've sent me emails saying, hey, it works just fine in mine, so it's your gun's fault. That's great for you. My carbine will not take this. I would be surprised how many carbines actually can take it. End of the day, guys, if you're looking for good, cheap, quality ammo for your AK-47, uh, plinking ammo, that is, go ahead and jump on Tula. Uh, at my expense, I found out that it works great. You guys take it easy, and God bless.